For this video in the Pharmaceutics video series, we will be showing you how to gown for both a non-hazardous and hazardous preparation. Once you enter the lab, walk straight back towards the table with all of the materials for gowning. The first thing you're going to put on are your booties. The benches serve as a barrier to sterile and non-sterile areas of the anteroom. Make sure you do not cross over to the sterile part of the anteroom until your gowning is complete. Next, you are going to put on a beard mask, if applicable, and a face mask. Make sure that the face mask has the blue part on the inside. Next, you are going to put on a pair of goggles, and then a hairnet. Use the vertical mirror to make sure that all of your hair is covered. Now you can walk straight back towards the sink and wash your hands. Make sure you wash all the way up to the elbows for at least 30 seconds. Walk back over to the table and go ahead and put on your gown. Make sure that the back is properly fastened and tied. Go ahead and use hand sanitizer to sterilize your hands and then put on your gloves. Make sure your hands have dried before you attempt to put the gloves on. Finally, spray your hands with ethanol. Now you can go ahead and exit the ante room and go into the buffer room. Hazardous gowning starts very similarly to non-hazardous gowning. You're going to go ahead and put the booties on first. For hazardous gowning, you are going to wear two layers of booties. Next, you are going to put on a beard mask, if applicable, and a face mask. Make sure that the face mask has the blue part on the inside. Next, you are going to put on a pair of goggles, and then a hairnet. Use the vertical mirror to make sure that all of your hair is covered. Now you can walk straight back towards the sink and wash your hands. Make sure you wash all the way up to the elbows for at least 30 seconds. Walk back over to the table and go ahead and put on your gown. For hazardous gowning, you are going to need to wear a hood. Go ahead and place this over your head after you put on your gown. Now you are going to put on your bunny suit. Make sure that the gown comes up over the booties. Zip your bunny suit and make sure the hood is properly enclosed.
Go ahead and use hand sanitizer to sterilize your hands and then put on your gloves. Make sure your hands have dried before you attempt to put the gloves on. This time you are going to use two pairs of gloves. Finally, spray your hands with ethanol. The final gowning should look something like this.